What is up, YouTube? Hi. Giving honor to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, first and foremost. Always. My name is Marcus. I'm Christian. This is Marriage for Dummies Reacts. Reacts. Today, we have a request from Sam Alvin. What's up, Sam? Hi. It's going to be Cooper Allen, Jesus Saves. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and like, subscribe, and we love you. We do. All God right, bless y'all. I like how you switch it up, Sam. <laughs> uh -huh. I ain't gonna lie, yeah, I've sold some lies Had too much fun on some Saturday nights Pride gets the best of my hard head sometimes My straight and narrow's got swerves Grace isn't what I deserve Oh, I ain't a Sunday morning choir I'm a dirty boots in the back pew backslider All right, yeah, I want to get my pizza in, and then I'm going to let it run out. It's such a good song. All right. Yeah. First, if you want us to react to a particular song you're choosing, the best way to get us to do that is go into our description. We got Cash App, Venmo, PayPal links. Click on one of those, send a donation along with the name of the song you want us to react to, and we'll hop on it. All right. Um, I like songs like this. Uh, why? Because it's not talking about how sanctified he is. Mm. It's talking about, do, do y'all understand that, there is a epidemic of people believing that they have to be clean to come to God mm. that yeah. hide from God because they like, um, God, just give me some time at some point I'll decide to get it all together and then I'll come to you. You see what I'm yeah. saying? But, but no, you just, I'm telling you, you go to God in your current state and then, yeah. Yeah. I yeah. love that. Go to God in your current state yeah. and then he will work with you until you are you you're you have a change of heart you can even want different things from god but know in your heart dang, in my heart i don't want to want different things than god want mm, for me yeah but i do though i want to be at a club every night i want to be doing this and that such a, i want to do these things that i used to do but it, yeah like you could go to god and he'll change your heart to want to want what he wants for your life yeah uh, but you just got to go to him first you I see what i'm that. saying go to him first and then you don't understand like i know right now you're like dang man i want to i i love god but right now i want to do these things well yeah. i'm telling you you can try them try them mm -hmm. and your heart will change you know what i'm saying and yeah yeah it, it ain't gonna be like how you feel right now always mm, i love that yeah yeah it was something so uh great about these songs where they're basically self-deprecating like look i ain't all that i know that i'm not worthy of being saved but jesus saves and yeah. let those kind of songs just are so resonating and so important because we too were those type of people where when when god did manifest in our lives and we were saved we were like what like why us and that's such a special feeling of mm -hmm dude he even saves me like he mm -hmm. takes time out of his eternal life mm -hmm. <laughs> uh to make sure that he um that that we're, that i'm saved you know what i'm saying and that's such a beautiful love that we can't conceptualize fully as a human but yeah. the best way that you can is understanding that you weren't worthy of it yeah. and then from there it makes you be able to love others with that kind of love that jesus loves you with you know and at least yeah. try to <laughs> yeah jesus saved me so i'm really cocky about what he could do with you all right I'm really <laughs> cocky you know what i'm saying Amen. like <laughs> i dude, love that he saved me so <laughs> so i'm just saying i'm just saying i don't know man like the fact that he saved me <laughs> like i'm yeah. pretty cocky about him um him uh manifesting in your life too. yeah his capabilities yeah. are pretty high up there yeah <laughs> He could save me. Yeah, yeah. I love that. But yeah, love these songs. Let's get to it. I guess he believes in someone like me. Cause he sees back together in all broken things. The man that I've been ain't who I'm gonna be. In the back pew, 
This, uh, I can't tell if this is the first time I've heard Cooper Allen, but right? it's a beautiful song. I don't think I've ever seen him, so yeah. that on that little picture, yeah. I don't think. Huh? But my memory, you can't go off a pregnant lady's memory, yeah. so you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but if it is a first time listen, that's a an impressive song. first time listen. Yeah. It really is. Yeah, it's like that. That's how you know when someone truly has a relationship with God, yeah. when they're able to speak on these things, yeah. like where a lot of, a lot of, you know, followers of Christ, they will tend to want to be the saints. Like yeah. I am a saint. There's nothing you can tell me. And yeah. it's like a big argument within the Christian community and things like that. And yeah. The only thing about it is that it is sanctification is a process. Yeah. And so if, if you already think that you're at the precipice of being a saint, yeah, then that's the issue. That's yeah. where the relationship with Jesus starts becoming a little weird yeah. because at no point are you Jesus yeah. and at no point on, and on, while you're here on this earth, yeah. are you pure enough yet? Yeah. And so, um, but that's the beauty of what keeps you in constant relationship with God is yeah. that you're constantly checking. Am I, am I that great of a, per, am I yeah. doing that? I don't, I don't think I'm quite there yet. You know what I mean? And yeah. that is really what builds your relationship with God, yeah. you know? And, so I love these type of songs for sure, and it's important in a and getting people to understand in their their walk with faith, especially yeah. new people. You know what I mean? That are just getting into their relationship with God is understanding that it's an everyday process. Yeah. But yeah, we love you so much, <laughs> and we'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.